Hello and welcome to this Windows tutorial video hosted by Adam Pierce of Strawberry 7. In this tutorial video I'll be showing you how to change the PDF, default PDF handler application. Um, in Windows 10, often after updates or something's happened to the computer, the PDF handler, um, i.e. the application that opens PDF files, gets changed from Adobe Reader to Microsoft Edge. Microsoft Edge is okay, um, it can open some PDFs, but we have had a lot of users experience problems with this, especially when opening PDFs from websites or from school MIS. Uh, so we can change this back fairly easily. There are a few methods for doing this. Um, I'll detail a few here and I'll put in the description below a um, jump to each method so that you can go straight to which method you want to view. So to begin with, we'll start off with probably the easiest method, which is um, we've got a PDF file here, and we can see the Edge icon here. If we double-click on this, it will open in Microsoft Edge. So what we'll do is we'll just click the Start menu here. We'll just type in Reader to bring up Adobe uh, Reader. We'll click on that. And when Adobe Reader opens, what it will do is it will detect that it's not the default application and then it will ask us if we want to make it the default application. So that's what this box is asking here. So we click yes, we do want to make it a default application. It will then open another box with some instructions on. So we just follow those, they're quite straightforward. So we click continue. That will bring up another dialog box in just a second. Okay, we click change as it's telling us here. We click Adobe Reader. We click OK. We click OK and then we can close both of these boxes. And now Adobe Reader is set as our default uh, reader. So when we open this document, it will open in Adobe Reader. Method two, you have to have a PDF file on your computer already. So what that means is that the PDF file has to actually be visible here. It can be in a variety of places, on a shared drive, it doesn't matter as long as it's accessible as an icon here rather than going to a website or an MIS and just opening it from a website. You have to actually have the file here. So when you have file located, right click on the file and select the option Open With. Now, don't go straight to Adobe Reader. Go to Choose Another App. Select Adobe Reader here. Don't double click, just single click there. And then tick this box that says Always Use This App to Open PDF Files. Click OK. It will open in Adobe Reader and you'll see the icon here change. And method three is probably the most complicated. Um, it's not probably the method that I would recommend, but users of older versions of Windows will recognize this as the um, one of the ways of setting default applications that's been in Windows for a long time. So we uh, start by clicking on the Start menu and going to Settings. Click Apps. Click Default Apps. And there's a few ways of doing this, so we'll, we'll run through um, a few different ways of doing this. We can go choose default apps by file type. Okay, now this will take quite a while to um, load this list, um, because what it's going to do is it's going to show you every single file type that your computer um, knows about, and then it shows you the default application that's set to open that particular file type. So it takes quite a long time for it to build um, this list. And what we're looking for here is on the left hand side we're looking for PDF. So we'll just sort of skip a bit further down to the bottom. Okay, so we've got PDF just here. And it's currently set to Microsoft Edge, as you can see. So we can tap on that and select Adobe Reader. I'm not going to do that just for a minute because I'm going to show you um, another way that we can um, do this, which is a similar principle, where we can say set defaults by app. 
Okay, and this is a little bit quicker because we can just select Adobe Reader here, select Manage, and what this is doing is it's doing it kind of the other way around. So the first way we were saying what the default handler for PDF was, now we're going into Adobe Reader and saying what, D, what Adobe Reader can handle. So here we can see that Adobe Reader handles a few different file types and the PDF file type, which is the bit that we're interested in, is set to Microsoft Edge. So same principle as the other method, we just select it and then select Adobe Reader. So we will select it this time and we'll just say switch anyway and now Adobe Reader is set as the default handler and once again you can see the icon has changed to the Adobe Reader icon. As always, thank you for watching.